so um, welcome to my channel so today we'll be solving exercise concerning stack uh, especially uh, reversing a stack so we would like to reverse the order of an element on stack using two additional stacks so we have two stacks we have one stack and we need to reverse the order of elements so this is the stack this is the initial state and then the final state should be the same stack but with the element reversed so for this we will be using uh, two additional stacks because if I want to reverse that if I use just one additional stack so I'm popping this and pushing it down then seven then one and if I will do um, I will re-push the same element it will came in the same order so in order to do it uh, to reverse the element so what we will do is that we will use a second stack here we will pop this element and push it here so this one will become empty and then we will try to pop this element push it here pop and that so we will end up with this one so let it make it more clearer so we have here one stack it's the same that will be at the end so this is s and this is s it contains 172 at the end we should have this stack containing the same element but in reverse order we will use an auxiliary variable stack s1 and s2 in s1 i will put all the element of the stack as s so i will pop two push it here pop seven push it here pop one and push it here then I will uh, pop each element from S1 and push it in S2. So I will put one here, seven, and then two, and then I will pop two and push it here, pop seven, push it here, pop one and push it here, and I will end with the stack reversed. So we have uh, the same stack as we are using in the old examples, one, seven, two, and we want to reverse. So I will print the stack before reversing and after reversing and reverse obviously would take an address since we need to change the order of elements we need to change something in the stack so we need to use two stacks so we declare stack as one and as two and we should not forget to initialize the stack so s1 equal create a stack and s2 equal create a stack so obviously when popping and topping we need the element an element in order to get the top element so I need to loop over the first stack which is us and while using top we need uh, the stack so we need the reference us and address of e so I'll be uh, popping here so it takes address and since s is an address so pop us and I will push it push the element e in the first stack so address of s1 e so and then uh, when when we reach this far here it means that the stack s is empty and all the elements are in the reverse order in s1 and i need to loop again over s1 in order to push the elements in s2 so i will loop over s1 i will pop s1 and i will push in s to the element e now i will loop over s2 so i will loop over s2 i will take the top element i will pop s2 and i will push it in the initial stack which is s so this is it let's run it so we have first one s1 to create a stack so maybe it's it's small c no. create stack so we have in the stack 172 and when we have the output we have 172 in reverse order so even if we command these and we have an empty stack so everything will be working correctly 
So this is that for this exercise. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to send me by email or uh, write a comment on this video. And thanks for watching.